This is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line and the likelihood of a tension-packed occasion. Stay with us, we'll have all the action for you live right here on EA TV. Hello, wherever you happen to be, it's always a delight and a privilege to cover a match here at the Stade Vélodrome in Marseille. My name is Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and sitting next to me, ready to give you all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's France versus Germany. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. Here's the side France will go with. Mike Mignon begins in goal. Antoine Griezmann starts alongside Adrien Rabio in the centre of the park. And the striker today is Marcus Turam. Here's the starting lineup for Germany. Well, a 4 4 2 system relies on good combinations all over the pitch. The front two, the central midfield pairing, the fullback and winger, and of course the centre backs. If you can get these combinations right, you'll have a good team. And the contest begins. Kunde, Koman, Griezmann, now Rabio, Aurelien Chouameni. Now, do they mean business on this occasion? Turam, now with Rabio, really important piece of last ditch defending. Chance here. Just the ideal start. Well, let's look at this again. The one and two touch passing is absolutely outstanding to play around the pressure. And the finish is clinical. He just makes it look so easy, doesn't he? And the action underway again. The onus very much on Germany to find a response now. David Raum. Good move in the making from France. Rabio. Hernandez. Making sure nothing came of it. Emre Can. Well, can they open up the defence here? Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. 
Coman. Turan. Mbappe. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Oh, he's really up on the up here. The crossbar got in the way. Well, threat about it. Well, had that gone in, the game was firmly in their hands. Now, though, they've got to make sure they don't let this slip. Pavard. Now Griezmann. Turam. Coman. Just the challenge that was required. Viet. It's with Kingsley Coman. Return to Turam. Hernandez. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Kunde and given away to Ram it's a weighted pass Havertz oh that's a fine save Radio. Teo Hernandez now. And France pushing forward with options available. But quick thinking defensively. Coman. Jules Kunde on the ball. Can he make it count? The goal scored by Kylian Mbappe. And when it comes to instinctive finishing, this is your man. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a really nice ball to put him through. The vision to set up the chance is outstanding. And then it's a brilliant header by Mbappe. He really attacks the ball and makes just the right contact. That's a superb finish. away with the lead standing at 2-0 Emre Can Florian Wirtz now moving the ball impressively here well I think a classic commentator's curse just then couldn't make the ideal pass and teammates to play it to Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Griezmann. And now Rabio. Coman. Superb block on the back of the ball from the flank. Nicely timed tackle. Hul Krug, Florian Wirtz, Werner, and players waiting in the centre, Werner, well, tremendous block, high quality defending, it has to be, blocked again, Krug. Werner with it now. No worries for the keeper. Aurelien Chouameni. Theo Hernandez now. And the electronic board showing one additional minute. Mbappe. Turam. 
And no more time left. We've reached the halfway mark here at the Orange Vélodrome. Well, so much to like about what Antoine Griezmann has done in this game so far, Stuart. Well, he's run the game, hasn't he? Everything's gone through him. His passing has been excellent, and he's provided a goal-scoring pass as well. And so the ball is rolling again, and Germany have left themselves with a mountain to climb here in the second half. Can they respond? Well, he's gone back to give the free kick, the referee here. He tried to play advantage, but it didn't accrue. Possession changing hands. Breaking at pace. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Given away again. Radio. Teo Hernandez. Turan. Will he find the net? And a goal! Wonderful stuff as they accelerate away from the opposition. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect. And Komen couldn't hit this any better. What a great finish this is. So the action continues. And France really beginning to run away with this now. The scoreline threatening to get ugly. And the penalty has been given here. Well, no card, just a warning and a fair few protestations. Well, not every foul is a yellow card. I think the referee is right here. And he finds the net. No difficulties encountered. Well, as you can see, the keeper just stands still and the ball's hit down the side of him. It's a strange one in the end. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Griezmann. Now Rabiot. Turan. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Havertz. Oh, he's through here. Really important tackle. And well, they're going for the short one. What well, a good place to win it back, and let's see what it leads to. Now, this could really lift spirits. And disappointingly, not even close to hitting the target there. Yeah, he was looking to open up his body, guide it into the corner, but he's got it all wrong. It's a poor attempt in the end. Well, France have controlled possession, as you can see, and they've made good use of it. They really have played some good attacking football, and they look like scoring more. Yes, really going so well for them, and who knows, they might be able to craft another opportunity. Turam. Hernandez, 
And at the back post, waiting is Griezmann. Well, I suspected that might be difficult for the keeper, but I was wrong. Havertz. On to Werner. Wolf. The defender doing his job. And the substitution will occur now. Chance to cross. And continues his run. Kimmich. You certainly can't fault them for trying as they keep the pressure on. Well, that was a decent effort, and you just sense the goal's coming here. Kunde. This is Coman. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. In position. Well, what an opportunity squandered. Far too easy for the keeper. Mbappe. Now Griezmann. Interception to snuff out the danger. Well, on the cusp of the final whistle and the home side really prospering today. Stuart, interested to get your take. Yeah, clearly the better side. Obviously being fantastic up front, but it's their work ethic for me. They're just not happy unless they have the ball. And they're fighting to win it back whenever they do lose it. It's been a really great performance all round. Rabio. Oh, surely! He's blocked it! An alert intervention. Hernandez. Mbappe in the centre. Oh, fantastic effort. He made great contact, but the keeper more than equal to it. Trying to pick out a teammate. It might be. Clear foul play, and as a result, a free kick forthcoming. Just ten minutes remaining here. Marcus Tuham. Who can he pick out? Might it be Mbappe? And doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today. A constant threat to this back line. Well, they are committed to making the substitution here. Griezmann tasked with taking the corner and cleared off the line. High class defending right on the goal line. Mario Götze. Five minutes to go. Raum. Options in the middle. Oh, a fine block. And the cross goes in. It comes to nothing in the end. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Oh, fancy footwork. Mbappe! Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. And a time for cool heads. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. And now, passing it through. Havertz. He read the situation defensively and did his job.
Mbappe. Oh, could be. Well, from and the final whistle has sounded. A victory here for France. Stuart, your thoughts on their performance? Well, Derek, they were dominant in most aspects of the game, particularly in that midfield area, and they also looked threatening in the top third of the pitch. It's a really good result for them. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, I thought his all-round game was excellent. It was his ability to find space that impressed me most, and with a bit more luck, he could have had a second one today.